YouTube drama is out of control. And it's getting worse as every day goes on, as every month, as every week, as every year goes on. It just gets worse. The worst part is not the person behind the drama. The worst part are the fans of the person behind the drama because they see their idol as they can do no wrong and they will relentlessly attack someone without all the facts. It's gotten to the point where it's no longer fun to do anything anymore. I don't do YouTube as a job. I do it as a hobby. I like uploading videos. I like talking to people. I like making commentaries. I like making gameplays. It'll just, it's just fun. And it's gotten to the point where I'm starting to be afraid of making someone mad because their fans are relentless. Old or young, your fans see you as an idol to them. It doesn't matter if they're 5 or they're 85. As long as you seem to be this high and mighty person, they will look at you as an idol that is when it gets bad these fans are relentless and they will defend you relentlessly and even though you may be in the wrong there's no way there's no way that their idol could be wrong so they attack and they keep going and they do not stop attacking until the other person winds up in a heap in a pile of their own demise of just tears or anything and the worst part is is when you blatantly tell your fans to attack someone that is when you've gotten out of control you control an army and you're now allowing that army to take out whoever they please because it's their agenda to do so you're an idol to these people it doesn't matter who you are If they look at you as someone who is possibly better than anything else, as soon as the lights come on, you're no different. Everyone's got skeletons in the closet, and it turns out yours are pretty bad. So when it gets to the point of when you have your own fans attack other YouTubers because you believe that that should be done, you're in the wrong. And the worst part is is your fans will just relentlessly defend you even though that you're wrong. No matter what, nobody thinks for themselves anymore. They get the facts from third parties. They they don't research it themselves. They don't look into it. They, they, they just do it. It's... It's, their, it's the sheep mentality, it's the hive mind, that you just do whatever your shepherd tells you to do. You never seem to look away from this pack that you're in, and you never seem to think that outside of this there is more. Well, guess what? One person tries to come along and tries to convince you that what you're doing is wrong. But guess what? The shepherd tells you they're the wolf, so you stay away from that person. Even though that person is not a wolf, they're a shepherd of their own trying to lead you on a right path. But it doesn't work that way. It never works that way. It's always seen as some sort of agenda to go and destroy whoever the your idol, whoever this YouTuber that told you to do so, to go do it. And every single time, they are relentless. It's like they don't even have a moral compass anymore it's always always kill yourself faggot kill yourself go die do you not understand that a lot of times people cannot take a joke and even though you may say you're joking guess what it's not taken that way and when about 50,000 people tell you this constantly then how can you take it as a joke how can you even pretend it's a joke It is absolutely wrong to just start something because you believe it's bringing worthwhile content to your fans. And another thing is you're not perfect. No one is perfect. And to pretend that you're perfect is the absolute worst. To pretend that you are high and mighty is what gets everyone on your side. And then suddenly that is what starts your downfall. Think for yourselves. If you can take away one piece of advice from me today is to think for yourselves. 
You do not need someone else telling you what to do or how you should act or what you should eat, wear, think, anything. You need to wake up and realize that you're your own person and you have a brain and your brain is you and it's your job to come up with your own opinions. Do not relentlessly go after someone. This isn't right. And it's not funny. It's not a joke. It's not just a prank. It's not any of those things. It's wrong. And you're a terrible person for doing so. This commentary is a very serious commentary. I'm not going to have any jokes in here. Because it disgusts me. I'm disgusted looking at all the people going to comment sections on videos and only seeing people that are blind to different things. Open your eyes and look for yourself. YouTube drama is getting out of control. And no matter what, if you are one of the causes behind the drama and you are deciding to make a reply or some sort of defense for yourself, realize that your fans love you to the point of where they will go and they will attack that person. This is your fight. Do not let anyone else fight it for you. That's cowardice and it's wrong. I'm just so tired of YouTube drama. The platform isn't fun anymore. Every big YouTuber has an army. And if they get in a squabble, it becomes a war. Because the two armies will relentlessly attack each other. Attack the fans, attack the content creator themselves and it's just gotten out of hand if you can take away one thing from this video get the facts before you attack or defend someone youtube drama is out of control do not be a sheep my name is the ungifted gamer and i will see you guys next time